Believe me, I think 20, 26 degrees, we're going to get there, I really do. Don't know what Barbara was predicting this morning, she didn't really let me in on the picture, to be very honest. Held her hands, you know, close to the, you know, close to the chest. It's Tuesday, April the 4th, and I uh, want to welcome along everybody that's watching this morning. Check this out. That's right, you're right here at Galaxy 107 FM and absolutely elated because we're heading over to Ohio yeah, Ohio <laughs> to catch up with our very, very good friends from the Southern Outlaws Band including Alice. Snap. first of all, let's welcome everybody that's uh, checking us out this morning. If you're going to watch a little later on over there on YouTube, you know what to do, right? No, you do. Seriously, you do. Sub, thumb, bell. Bingo. Uh, bell notifications when we have important people like the Southern Outlaws Band joining us. Also, why not subscribe? Yeah, sub. Do it. Become part of the family. We call it the noise here at Galaxy. We really do. And thummy thing, you know what to do with that. You get epileptic with it. Go on. A dozen, dozen times. Yeah, it's like a video game, isn't it? Go on. Double, triple dare you. But in the meantime, nice to have you on board. Today, we're talking to Alice, Sandy, Tim, new guy in the band. Yep. Uh, I think Mike's on TV, which is on TV. And, of course, uh, Bob's in the background as well, looking handsome as ever. Yes, it's a Southern Outlaws band. Brand new song, One Hell of a Woman, must be about Sandy. You're right here at Galaxy. <laughs> So, okay, Sandy, it's about you, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I, I wish I would say, yeah, that, no. They wrote it about female guitar players. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, do you know what? One artist once asked me, great beard, what do you feed it? I said, female bass players. Hey, everyone. <laughs> there you go. So I understand, Alice, about that. Uh, <laughs> dear, 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 dear. Hey, um, by the way, I found out, you, you know that we're coming into Easter, don't you? This Good Friday is this Friday? Yeah. Yeah. I <laughs> this is where it gets R-rated, by the way. Uh, I found out why <laughs> the Easter Bunny hides his eggs in the backyard. I don't know. Yeah, well, if you're having sex with chickens, would you want everybody to know? <laughs> well, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> I was hey, going to use the F well, word, but hey. When we were in Arizona, this one back here picked up a girl that wound up taking him to breakfast, and guess what? She took him to a vegan restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> Tim, did you try the sausage? <laughs> Didn't you say who said the same thing? What well, he said the same thing? <laughs> um, yeah, no. 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 Okay. <laughs> this is. Did you at least try the vegan bacon? <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't try the bacon, Norris. Damn it. it was a bacon. Tim, oh, I ask everybody this, and you're no exception now. Um, is vegan sausages made out of real vegans? No. <laughs> no. Fake. No. It's like they're printing it. Well, was she a vegan? Was that? Was the lady vegan? that took yeah. you to the restaurant, she was a vegan? Yeah. Did, yeah. did they hang out together? Vegans? Did they get together? Did they go to the pub? I mean, I don't know. Well, well, that morning we only seen one vegan. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you, you see, I, I, I ran into a vegan the other day and asked her the same question. Do you guys go to the pub? Do you hang out? She goes, why? I says, because the only place to see you is on the news. <laughs> <laughs> I said, you know, if you go to the pub and you get a little drunk, you might fi find that you're a little upset with each other. Do you go out to the car park, have a dust up? She goes, it has happened. <laughs> 
I went, is that called having a beef? Hi, Billy. <laughs> <laughs> If you get hit in the face, is that called slapping the chops? <laughs> Tim, I can go on like this all day, honestly. I really can. <laughs> uh, well, here's one for you. I was talking to a five-star restaurant chef the other day, right? And I actually okay. said to him, what's well, the hardest thing about cooking in the kitchen? And he goes... Vegetables. I went, yep, know what you mean? Getting the wheelchairs in the oven must be a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, don't even oh. get me on vegetable oil, okay? Is he writing all of them down? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, let's go on! <laughs> Dear oh, dear oh, dear oh, dear oh, dear oh. <laughs> guys in the fish bowl, you need to wake up. Good morning, guys. Hey, nice to have everybody on board, too. Got to say hi to Franco Danucci. It's been a week of partying because the wife has had a birthday. Absolutely brilliant. Roxanne Cloverdale, <laughs> uh, Roxy, nice to have you on board, Black Market 3, looking forward to catching up with you, really, really love, love, love uh, your new song as well, I really do, Lisa Saunders is joining us, nice to have you on board, Lisa, April Dawn is watching, Terry Williams is watching, Joss Bynes, hello Joss, nice to have you on board, JD on Cat, and uh, April Dawn, yep, I said that, Lisa Saunders, JD on Cat, April Dawn, April Dawn, Sharon Marie White is joining us. Hello, Sharon. Nice to have you on board as well. Cheryl Arnold and Black, uh, Billy McKnight. Billy! Hello, buddy. Nice to have you on board. Donnie Coulter as well. Nice to have everybody on board. Today we're talking to the whole band. New member too, by the way, and we've subjected him to a little bit of DJ Grant already. He's going to go and see a psychiatrist after this. Either that or have a stiff drink, one or the other. Is <laughs> Tim... We're talking to the Southern Outlaws band coming out of Ohio. Welcome back, guys. Oh, it's always a pleasure. Always. Always. Definitely. Definitely a pleasure, Graham. Pleasure. Nice to see you. I hope everybody's enjoying the new song. Well, we really are, I've got to be honest with you. And, uh, well, I'm also enjoying the new singer. We've made sure that it goes into the breakfast show and other different places as well. So thank you for that. Loving the T-shirt, Jackal. You like that? Yeah. I wore that specifically for you. Thank you. Yep. Love it. Love it. Love it. Uh, I see uh, Mike hasn't caught a fish yet. No. No, he hasn't caught a fish. He's at his camp right now. <laughs> He's just hanging around. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they said the same thing about Jesus, though, didn't they? Yeah. <laughs> and then Bob couldn't join us. He had to work, so. Damn. Damn. Bob. <laughs> we we work's more important. That's unheard of. <laughs> it really is. Tim, how did you meet these guys? Well, um, Sandy and Dave have been coming out, and they've seen me um, with other acts and various musical things. Um, and they, I came back from the Middle East in 2020, and. Um, they got me involved doing fill-ins, and then I ran sound for a little bit, and then they called me, and they're like, you want to go on tour? And I was like, well, hell yeah, I want to go on tour, and here we are. <laughs> now, Tim, you so, said you came back from the Middle East. Now, you're a return serviceman. Yes. Which, uh, which form of service were you in? Army. Army Guard. Okay. Well, nice and, and respect for you, my friend. I really do have a little bit of respect. Um, I was in the services as well, but I was lucky enough not to be in any skirmishes anywhere, any time. But I am a return serviceman as well. I actually got billeted out to Fiji to roll an airport backwards and forwards. On you know, that's all I did. As long as I had my uh, SOR with me, <laughs> I was safe. You know what I mean. But I spent six months going up and down the same patch of runway, uh, only for it to be decommissioned about six months after we did it. 
You gotta love that. You gotta love that. <laughs> really do, you really do. Uh, Bo Gregory is joining us as well. And um, Stephen G. Knight. Now, Stephen, I hope you're getting better. I heard you're uh, feeling a bit poorly lately. Uh, and believe me, bro, we are concerned. So please, please, please take care of yourself. We really have a better world with you in it, my friend. We really do. George Prophet's in there and Wolf Milestone. Nice to have you on board, Wolf. It really, really is. Today we're talking to the Southern Outlaws. And now we played one hell of a woman. Apparently it's not about Sandy. Alice, explain yourself, please. <laughs> okay. Well, we wanted to wind up uh, writing a song that paid tribute to a lot of the female guitar players that are out there. And there's so many of them. And we didn't think they're getting as much recognition, so we wanted to pay tribute and honor to them. Uh, we think they're all one hell of a women, you know. And uh, we wound up doing a song. Dave came up with the riff, and uh, we just started putting it together. And and uh, now we've got a. I think a, a lot of the women are are making that their national anthem at this yeah. point. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Is there a dance that goes with it as well? Not yet. Not yet. No, yet. Actually, his sister is actually comprising a, yes. a dance for it. Yeah, she is, she's a ballroom dancer. Yeah, she's part of it. And uh, they are actually putting something together. Putting something together. You know, uh, my greatest step is the box. <laughs> I know what you mean. Yeah, yeah believe me, I, I'm so good at box. I, get me to do anything else, yeah, pfft, no way. <laughs> but I, I'm not bad at a box there. The box. I can't do the box at all. No, I can't do the yeah. no, box. No. Okay. No, no. Mine's more of a trapezoid. <laughs> well, I, my, my other good dance step is actually walking away from the bar. I do a great line. <laughs> We can handle that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'd rather great wine and uh, going to the bar rather than coming away from it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Dave Mate? can walk railroad tracks drunk. <laughs> <laughs> minus four degrees. Well, that's silly. I'd be mean, nowhere where it's minus four degrees. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, uh, and I've got to be honest with you here, my friends. Ten degrees and the heater goes on. Barbara can attest to this 10 degrees and the heater goes on. Well, Very it's quite true. simple, you see. I got no fat on me. I'm, I'm, you know, you can't fatten a thoroughbred, and many people have tried and failed. Definitely. <laughs> 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 uh, so true. I uh, totally agree with you. Yeah, well, you know, it happens that way. It really does. Uh, now, having said that, guys. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> My headphones fell out. Microphone is having problems. Yeah, okay. Thanks for that, guys. Nice for you to tell me. Uh, dear, oh dear, oh dear. We'll try this instead. Uh, sorry about that, but uh, it seems like the microphone has decided that it's going to go um, southwest and uh, the crew's trying hard to keep it going. Uh, let's go into Dumbass Walker <laughs> and tell me all about this. A. Who's the dumbass? Why is it walking? And B, is it related to me in any way? <laughs> uh, it's actually uh, Dumas Walker, which uh, was from good friends of ours, the Kentucky Headhunters. And we wanted to pay uh, respect and honor to them and wound up doing a new rendition and uh, put our own twist to it. And uh, we wound up... Uh, Doing that for them. Uh, keep talking for a minute, will you, bro? I'm just trying to sort something out here. Oh, uh, yeah. But yeah, we definitely wanted to wind up doing that. Like I said, uh, to me, you know, they're a great, uh, you know, Southern Rock uh, Outlaw Country band. It's been around for a long time. Um, and. Uh, yeah, it's just an honor to wind up doing one of their songs for them and put our twist to it. We've had a lot of um, people back. Yeah. All right, and so start the dump. 
but I think me and Dave probably got the tie on that one. Yeah. <laughs> well, I tell you what, uh, 3,157 requests for it so far. So yeah, you're getting a good positive feedback for it, that's for sure. Uh, also, uh, believe me, I was wondering where the extra ass went to, you know, where the extra ass on dumbass went to, so uh, do us. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we kind of read things here as we say them, you know what I mean? It, it looks like... Yeah, right. absolutely. And, uh, well, you know something? Maybe I'm the dumbass. You never know. In the meantime, you're right here at Galaxy 107 FM, joined live today by, of course, Alice Walker and the rest of the crew, minus one who's actually fishing, minus another one who's working. Here's Dumas Walker. Oh, what's the temperature over there right now then? Actually, it's pretty warm today. <laughs> what is it, Michelle? 65. 65. Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit. Okay, well, let me check this out. Da -da -da -da. 16. Um, 63 outside right now. We're at 63 outside. Okay. So we're pretty close. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Pretty close. Add yeah. another 10 oh. degrees for inside here. And it's getting bloody warm, to be honest with you. We've got plenty of computers and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Hi, Jim. Yep. I just thought it was Grant. And, uh, it was Terry Robinson is joining us. Jim Buffett. Hello, Jim. Nice to have you on board. Country Music Social Media. Hey guys, love your work, really, really do. Keep it up, we're so very honoured to be a part of your guys' crew. And um, also Anthony T. Schmidt, hello buddy. Really, really looking forward to uh, catching up with you in the near future Thank as you. well. Of course, Anthony's coming out of Melbourne, Australia. We love that. Truly an international um, following this morning. Um, how many countries have you know? 181. Okay, 181 countries around the world right now are tuned out. That's awesome. It's not bad. It's not bad. Um, how many cities? Okay, 2,612 cities around the world tuned out. Awesome. Not nice. bad. Not bad. Got to thank everybody for participating this morning. It's such a pleasure. It really is. We love doing our job. And it, we can't call it work. No. When we have friends like Alice and the crew with us, um, Sandy, I hope you know that um, we absolutely love the work you do. We really, really do. Please keep these guys in line, won't you? Yeah. I try. <laughs> yeah, I, try. <laughs> I try. I'm sure Alice has got a couple of pairs of handcuffs floating around somewhere. You know, if they get out of hand, Tom. <laughs> yep. We like it rough, you know. <laughs> I really didn't need to hear that. Okay, sorry. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Mm, Tim, you've made me think strangely about you. Next thing you'll be things. telling me you like to drink Coca Cola. Where's the my head? <laughs> Tread carefully. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <clears throat> but let me tell you, Tim, I used to be a stand up comedian. Now I'm sitting down doing it. Yes, I can see you. <laughs> Right, you're right here at Galaxy 107 FM, and well, still having mic problems. 
going to have to get the IT guys and all the crew in to uh, have a look at the uh, desk. I think we are literally, yeah, antiquated old thing. We really do need that new desk delivered ASAP. Uh, but in the meantime, folks, i uh, got to say uh, thank you. I hope, you know, gosh, he's been doing no fishing. He hasn't spoken at all, literally. Um, you okay down there, my friend? Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike, he's asking if you're okay. Yeah, I'm outside Gallagher's firewood up. Firewood? Campfire. Oh, okay, I was going to say, since when do the... Were you going to build a raft or something for the fish? <laughs> I'm out picking up sticks, man. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I do that too when the missus gets upset with me. <laughs> it's cool. Go and get some firewood, stuff like that. Uh, anyway, guys, don't go anywhere just yet because uh, we are going to do the after photo we thing as everybody but Tim knows it's going to be in for a shock yeah. really uh, but in the meantime uh, take very very good care I think I've lost it all together now we'll see what happens A B C D E maybe there we go we'll try that B well, yep just... maybe maybe not there we go do our best anyway. In the meantime, have a very happy and successful day. Uh, today we're in Ohio, catching up with good friends of ours, yes, Alice Walker and the Southern Outlaws Band, right here at Galaxy. And uh, we were talking about Dumas Walker and, of course, one hell of a woman. Have a very happy and successful day. See you very shortly. <laughs>